Oh, hey, Professor Ginger. Hey, Axel. Do you guys want to play a game? <coughs> All right, we're going to play a game with 3D shapes or solid figures. What I'm going to do is show you a picture of a solid figure. Then you're going to go into the house and find something that is the same shape as that solid figure. Got it? <coughs> All right, let's go. All right, Professor Ginger. Okay, Axel. Your first shape I need you to find in the house is a cylinder. A cylinder has two flat surfaces and no vertices, no corners. All right, go inside the house and I want both of you to find two things that are shaped like a cylinder. Ready? All right, go find them. Wow, good job you guys, you were fast. All right, let's see. Axel got two rolls of toilet paper and Ginger got a container of cleaning wipes and disinfectant spray. Whoa, guys, where did you find that stuff? I've been looking for that stuff for months. Hey, let's take a closer look. All right, let's look at the disinfectant spray first. I don't see any vertices or corners. I see a flat surface that's a circle on the bottom and a flat surface that's a circle on the top. Good job, Ginger. Let's look at your wipes. All right, I don't see any vertices or corners, but I see a flat surface shaped like a circle on bottom and a flat surface shaped like a circle on top. Good job, Ginger. You found two cylinders. Well, let's look at your toilet paper, Axel. All right, I don't see any vertices or corners, but I see a circle flat shape on top and a circle flat shape on the bottom. Nice job, Axel. You got two toilet papers. Ginger also found two cylinders. Way to go, guys. All right, guys, your next 3D shape or solid figure is a cone. Check it out. Here's a cone. It has a corner or one vertex on the top, and the bottom has one flat surface that is shaped like a circle. Here's your picture of a cone. All right, this one's tricky, guys, so you'll only have to find one. Go inside and find something that's shaped like a cone. Wow, guys, you guys came back quickly. Oh, Ginger, I love your Santa hat. And it looks like Axel found a gray megaphone. All right, let's look at your objects closer and see how they're shaped like a cone. All right, let's look at Axel's megaphone first. It's not a perfect cone, but it goes up to a point at the top and the bottom is shaped in a circle. Nice job, Axel, for finding something that's shaped like a cone. All right, let's look at Ginger's Santa hat. All right, so it's shaped to a point at the top and when you look at the bottom, it's in a circle shape. Nice job, guys, finding a cone each, good job. Okay guys, your next solid figure or 3D shape is a cube. Check it out. A cube has six flat surfaces. Each flat surface is shaped like a square. It also has eight vertices or corners. All right, here's your picture of a cube. All right, guys, I want you to go inside the house and find something, one thing each, that's shaped like a cube. Can you do it? <coughs> All right, good. Go ahead. Nice job coming back quickly, guys. Oh, it looks like you guys grabbed the same thing. Ginger, you have a purple die, and Axel, you have a yellow die. There are two dice up on that table. Hey, scholars, what number does Ginger's purple die show? Good four. What number does Axel's yellow die show? <laughs> right, five. Who's got the bigger number? Yeah, Axel's number five is bigger. Good job, don't tell Ginger. All right, guys, let's look at your items closer and see how they're shaped like a cube. All right, let's look at Axel's yellow die. Remember, Ginger's is exactly the same. It's a cube shape, all right. We have one, two, three, four, five, six flat surfaces shaped like a square. And we've got one, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight corners or vertices. Good job, Professor Ginger and Axel. You both found a cube. Nice job. All right, guys, your last 3D shape or solid figure is called a sphere. Check it out. A sphere is like a round ball. It has zero flat surfaces and zero vertices, zero corners. All right, let me show you the picture. I want you to go inside the house and find something that's shaped like a sphere. Think you can do it? Yeah, go get it. Wow, good job, you guys. Coming back quickly. It looks like Ginger found a baseball. Good job. And it looks like Axel has a little cat jingle ball toy. Way to go, guys. Let's look at your items a little closer. All right, let's look at Axel's little cat toy first. It's round. It doesn't have any flat surfaces. And it doesn't have any vertices or corners. Good job, Axel. You found a sphere. All right, let's look at Ginger's baseball. All right, here's Ginger's baseball. It doesn't have any vertices or any flat surfaces. Good job, Ginger. You found a sphere too. Nice job. Great job, Professor Ginger and Axel, finding things in the house that are shaped like 3D shapes. You guys each found two things shaped like a cylinder, one thing shaped like a cone, one thing shaped like a cube, and one thing shaped like a sphere. Great job, guys. Thanks for helping me make this video.